Hola, soy Profe Cronister. Let's talk about how to use the present progressive tense with reflexive verbs. We use the present progressive in Spanish to say that something is happening right now. And it's very similar to the ing ending in English. Before watching this video, you might want to review the video on reflexive verbs. I use a lot of vocab from that video in this one. Why do we need to use this tense? First, we need the verb estar. We also need either an AR, ER, or IR verb. And finally, the present progressive endings endo or yendo. Let's look at some examples of non-reflexive verbs first. Let's use the ER verb comer to say she is eating. First, we conjugate estar, drop the ER ending off of comer, and add the yendo ending which gives us, está comiendo, she is eating right now. Feel free to pause the video to review if you need it. Staying with ER verbs, we have correr to run. It follows the same rules, but let's say that I am running this time. Well, we conjugate estar, drop off the ending of correr, and add yendo, which gives us, estoy corriendo, I am running right now. Let's try an AR verb, escuchar, and let's say that he is listening. Same formula with a minor change. We still conjugate estar, but now we only need to drop the R from the verb and add the endo, which gives us está escuchando, he is listening right now. Our last AR verb is hablar, to talk. Pause the video. See if you can figure out how to say they are talking. Hopefully you conjugated a star into a stan, dropped the R from hablar, and added an endo to give you a stan hablando. So the general rule for using the present progressive is that you need a form of a star. Estoy, estás, está, estamos, están, estáis if you're in Spain, and add an AR, ER, IR verb, drop the R from the AR verb, and add the endo ending, or drop the ER, IR ending, and add yendo. This is the present progressive, and it means I, you, he, she, it, we, they, or y'all are doing something right now. Well, using the present progressive with reflexive verbs follows the same rules. We just need to know where to put the reflexive pronouns. The me, te, se, nos, and the plural se. Let's look at some reflexive verbs. Bañarse, to bathe oneself. Levantarse, to lift oneself or to get up. Lavarse, to wash oneself. Cepillarse, to brush oneself, hair or teeth usually, and sacarse, to dry oneself. Step one, remove the se and conjugate the verb into the ing ending. This gives us bañando, levantando, lavando, cepillando, and secando. Staying with bañarse, step two is to conjugate the correct form of estar. Now this gives us Yo estoy bañando, tú estás bañando, él, ella, usted está bañando, nosotros estamos bañando, and ellos, ellas, ustedes están bañando. Now, the final step is putting the reflexive pronouns back, and you have two options. The first option is to put one before the form of a star. This would give us me estoy bañando, te estás bañando, se está bañando, nos estamos bañando, and se están bañando. Option two is to put the reflexive pronoun at the end of the conjugated verb. This gives us estoy bañándome, estás bañándote, está bañándose, estamos bañándonos, and están bañándose. Note, if you're going to do it this way, the A gets an accent. 
I really can't say that one way is more common than the other. It's just a matter of personal preference. We're going to practice with four AR and three IR verbs. Remember the order, reflexive pronoun, conjugated form of a star, and then the verb with the present progressive ending. Or the second way is to add the reflexive pronoun to the end of the verb instead. Let's start with afeitarse to shave oneself. Conjugate it using the pronoun el to say that he is shaving himself. The steps are in blue. Pause the video if you need time to work it out. Did you get el se está afeitando or está afeitándose? Next is bañarse, which means to bathe oneself or to take a bath. Conjugate using the pronoun ella to say she is bathing herself. The steps are listed in blue if you need them. Feel free to pause the video for extra time. Well, did you get ella se está bañando or ella está bañándose? Now, levantar means to train oneself, like working out. Conjugate using the pronoun yo to say I train myself. Use the guide and pause button if you need it. Did you get yo me estoy entrenando? or estoy entrenándome? Well, let's try the next one. The last AR verb is ducharse, to shower oneself. Conjugate using the pronoun tu to say that you are showering. And use the guide if you need it. Did you get te estás duchando or estás duchándote? Now, these IR verbs are irregular. So even though we can conjugate them using the present progressive rules, we need to make a small change. Vestirse has an E to I change, and dormirse has an O to U change. Pause the video and see if you can conjugate them using ellos for vestirse and nosotros for dormirse. Use the guidelines in blue if you need help. Did you get the answer shown below? Did you see the stem change? Vestirse changed to vistiendo and dormirse changed to durmiendo. Let's give the last one a shot. Sentirse is an irregular verb and it means to feel. Conjugate this with the pronoun yo to say I am feeling. Pause the video so you have time to figure it out. Okay, did you get me estoy sintiendo or estoy sintiéndome? Thanks for watching and I hope you found it helpful. If you have any questions, please comment in the section below. Gracias and adios.